And that's the Healing Streams promo, really telling you a exciting. lot of what we're going to expect uh, today. Exciting, yes, James, indeed it's, it's exciting. It's just, I can't wait, it's, it's hours to exactly. go, and I, I'm, I'm already shaking, I'm already feeling oh, it in James, my spirit, you know. James, calm down, <laughs> I know it's <laughs> coming up. But we actually have Apostle Oral Hazel from Global Life Church St. Thomas from the Virgin Islands joining us now. Apostle, you're very welcome to the program. Thanks, thanks for having me today. Thank you. All the way from share. the Virgin Islands. I know you've been preparing for this program. Tell us more about how you've been preparing for this program. Well, yes, we, we have been preparing, uh, praying, um, getting excited, getting the word out, sending it out on the social media, let folks know that Healing Streams is coming up and it's time uh, for folks to receive their healing. It's always excited when you are sick and you know that someone is coming by to release the power, the presence, and the glory of God. I, I had the opportunity to be in Nigeria to see the explosion of the power, the presence, and the glory of God when the man of God, uh, Pastor Chris, um, released the power of God in the congregation. Uh, it, it was in uh, a, a Christ embassy where the power of God was released on the bottom floor. And he said, uh, are you folks at the top ready? Well, I said, if he's going to do that, I'm going to mix my faith with his faith. And I tell you, the power of God hit the top level. <laughs> I tell you, and that was a rumble of the power, the presence, the glory of God, the miraculous, the supernatural in display. And I believe this is a time hmm. for the supernatural to be manifested in the earth. And I tell you, there were people like uh, Katrin Kuhlman and all those men of God who have went on before, and they saw that entire hospitals were cleared out by the power of God. I'm expecting uh, while someone in a hospital looking at the app that the power of God drop in the hospital and clear out hospital wards, hospital rooms, and give the nurses and the doctors and the surgeon a break. The power of God wants to be manifested in the earth like we have never seen it before. So our man of God, Pastor Chris. Wow. Uh, Apostle, really inspired by what you said there, because we're in the end times, and you mentioned Catherine Kuhlman, and the Bible says the glory of the latter shall be greater than that of the former. And what you're saying yes. is that in our days, we're going to even see much more than what happened in the days of Catherine Kuhlman. And that's, you just gave an example of one of the highlights of what you saw when you were in Nigeria. And so you're expecting much more of that in every yes. nation of the world. Wonderful. We saw people in wheelchairs. They got up out of the wheelchairs, people in cots, people who were just there, I mean, just on their sick bed. They got up and walked, I mean, and ran. It was a jubilant time. I tell you, when you are sick and you're on your cot on your bed and someone comes to release the power, the presence, and the glory of God, and you, you are sense the power of God flowing through you and the anointing of God to resurrect your body. Hmm. Uh, it's a time, a jubilant time. I tell you, you don't know to run, to cry, to walk, put your hands up, spin. I tell you, and so that's the power of God we are expecting to drop in every home. That, that's it. Um, we are going into, we're going to uh, up this thing into the billions, multiply it, and let the power of God be felt in our nursing homes, hmm. in our hospitals, in our churches, in all the different stations that are going to be video casting it. We're expecting a tremendous explosion. We're expecting more miracles. Okay, and, and Jesus said it in the last days that we are going to be doing the stuff and we are going to see the greater miracles more than just opening the blind, Jesus walking mm -hmm. down the street, healing the person with the issue of blood. Mm -hmm. But I tell you, uh, our man of God, Much Pastor more. Chris, is walking in the power, the presence, the glory, the manifestation, the glory of God. I'm just believing that during this time that the glory of God will be manifested the glory of God will be seen. The glory of God will be felt 
in all areas of the earth. And that's an awesome thing because the word of God says that the word of God will be multiplied in the last day and everyone will be impacted with the word of God. And that is what Matthew says, go into all the world and preach the gospel, manifest Christ, manifest his power. And I tell you, the believers need to see the power of God and the unbelievers, they also need to see the power of God being displayed in the earth today. Thank I you tell so you, much, blowing the minds of the medical scientists. I mean, I tell you, a surgeon, I'm seeing um, tumors You are so disappear. passionate, You're sir. You're watching it. <laughs> I, can, I, can, I can actually feel it is <laughs> contagious and you are so passionate. But I was just <laughs> about to ask you, and you are actually saying that for those who are wondering, should they... Um, participate in this program what do you have for them to say what do you have to say to them rather briefly uh, yes I, I say if you don't have an app go to a center if you cannot see it via streaming um, going to somebody's home if you know someone that's sick get them into that person's home into that center let them hear the word let them see the power of God being displayed and, and it would fit with a rise on the inside of them for their personal miracle. So I'm believing because you see, Jesus, he deals one on one. The woman with the issue of blood, she had an issue, he dealt with her. The blind Bartimaeus, he had an issue, he was blind, he dealt with him. And so one therefore, on one. we are going to come together with all our sicknesses, diseases, and infirmity. And we're going to watch the power of God displayed. And that would also build faith on the inside of us just by seeing the cripples getting up out of their beds and running and walk and Thank doing you, miracles, signs one and wonders on one. like the That's Jesus what you style. Thank you. Which means there's a blessing for everyone. Mm. And you are saying everyone should participate. Mm. Thank you, Apostle. Yes, we have to it's... stop here. Thank you, Apostle Oro Hazel from the Virgin Thank Islands. you for having me. Thank you for Thank coming you, on the program.